Good morning, everybody. It is day two. So yesterday we ended up a little situation with the geothermal. Unfortunately, it's gonna really put this job behind because the guys can't come out until tomorrow to fix this. So we're just gonna keep on keeping on. What am I gonna do, quit? That's not an option, you gotta keep on keeping on. We're gonna keep on going on with our stream, getting that rocked in, the main waterfall rocked in, getting some of the sod done, getting as much as we can until we are able to get this basin in. But like I said, unfortunately, until tomorrow sometime i don't know we're not gonna be able to get this basin in kind of a bummer but you know sometimes this stuff happens on a job site you don't know what you're gonna run into and the thing is is to still have a great attitude about it and just keep on you know going with uh your installation on other aspects of the project that you can so i'm gonna turn this around and show you what we're doing today we got the guys right now getting our underlayment on top of our uh, dirt where our stream is we do have some rocky soil here so we want to make sure that we do protect uh, this liner when we put it in i'd rather be safe than sorry and fabric underlayment is cheap reinsurance right now like i said what we're going to do is we're going to get this underlayment in we're going to go ahead and get our liner in and we're going to start getting this this stream and waterfall rocked in and getting this part of it done today and then also what we did we started on the uh, swale that the customer wanted us to do so all the drainage that comes off of the driveway just comes along the lot line here and takes it down to the creek over there the guys just got done with putting in another drainage pipe got all this drainage in we actually had to put a box over here because the customer does get some water that comes off of this hill right here it ends up coming close to the house, so we wanted to put in a drain form right here. That way we can try to eliminate water from getting inside the house. So other than that, I'm gonna let you guys go for right now, and we're gonna get this thing rocked. Everybody, it is day three we finally got our geothermal line fixed the guys came out this morning and fixed that so thank you guys for getting that because now we can get our basin done let me show you what we got going on and mr. yaks behind ah! me <laughs> <laughs> it's been a blast having him here along with his crew so let me turn the camera around and show you what we've got done so far We've got our waterfall basically there. We still got to sculpt it and start building. We've got our main stream in three quarters of the way in. You guys did a great job on that. We're starting to get all of our sod next to it. We're basically trying to work from over here and work our way over to here and finish up as we're going. That way it's less that we have to do at the end. But right now we're finally getting the basin in. Finally, let me show you guys what we got going on. We've actually got two pieces 
of geotextile fabric inside the hole because right now you see a little bit of water coming up through and what's going on is we actually have an artesian well coming up so i've actually got two drainage pipes right in the middle here going all the way down this trench there's actually a creek all the way back there so we're taking all this drainage pipe out of our basin and all the way down to the creek that way any water that comes up here from our artesian is going to come up through these pipes and out that way our pondless basin doesn't float up on us so you can see we've got our three quarter of, three quarter of an inch cobble right now that we are going to put through the whole bottom of this that way any water that comes up is just going to basically drain right out of there in through our drains and out to the creek this is going to work out awesome sometimes you've got to deal with issues like this but it's knowing how to deal with these issues I'm gonna get going and helping these guys, and we'll chat at you guys a little bit later.